Everybody wanted our dinero. $3.2 trillion of the GDP. We're their main consumer. Who uses WhatsApp? Who uses Google? Who uses Facebook? They want our money. But yet we're not the jefas. We're not the makers. And they say it's a problem in the pipeline, but really, the pipeline is there. We're many knocking on the door. And unfortunately, from this 2% that work in tech, we're at the very bottom. We're stuck in entry-level positions. When you should be there for two years, we're there for five to 10 years. The system is not working for us, so that's what we're trying to do. You say everything has flaws. Why? Because the machine learns first from their creators. And are we the creators? We're definitely the consumers. We gotta move from being just the consumers to the makers, the creators, the innovators. And this is not something, yeah. Yeah, we got to do this. This is not a brand new idea. We're there. We're already working in tech. We just need to scale up, upper mobility. We got to go up and aim high. Not only thinking, oh, yeah, yeah, I want to be a front-end engineer. I'm going to go to the moon. I'm going to be Alan Ochoa. I'm going to invent the cure for cancer or create uh, uh, robotics, things that are moonshot because the machine learns from their creators and the technology needs us. It's our obligation really, by now, to change this for many generations to come. Get your voices heard. Ask for that race or that promotion. 95% of promotions and races are given to people that ask. And Latinos in our culture, we head down, do the best job we can until maybe somebody will tap on their back offering us something, and that is not how the game works in the United States. And hold the companies accountable. They cannot keep abusing the fact that we do not ask and pay us less. This is, they believe that we're cheap labor because we don't ask. We must make them accountable and we must ask. And by doing those two actions, we will make this ball roll nicely and fast.